ISIL has claimed responsibility for a deadly car bomb attack in Diyarbakir, southeast Turkey, according to a statement by its AMAK news agency. It's the first attack in Turkey that the group has laid claim to. At least nine people died as a result of the explosion, which took place near a building used by the riot police in the predominantly Kurdish town. Turkish officials initially blamed the outlawed Kurdistan Workers' Party, PKK, for the attack in the Balar district. The blast in the early hours of Friday morning came less than two days after the release of an audio message, purportedly recorded by ISIL leader Abu Bakr al-Baghdadi, in which he urged fighters to attack both Turkey and Saudi Arabia.